All right, so the next one we're gonna do is the hip bump sweep. Uh, this is again, a nice basic sweep. Uh, you got a lot of little details in it, but it'll be really effective, but we're gonna try to learn how to be really powerful with it. Okay, so anytime you're rolling, if your partner puts their hands on the floor, this is when they can get susceptible to the hip bump sweep. When you're on top, you always wanna to try to think hands on body. Anytime you get pulled down, them. You want your hands on your partner's body rather than on the floor because this is going to open up hip bump sweeps and kimuras and other things. So anyway, for this drill, if our partner has their hand on the floor, I'm going to grab the wrist. Same side, I'm going to sit up. So I need to scoop my hips out. I like going right over the closer to the shoulder rather than low by the elbow. I like going over. Now, even though I can't reach my wrist, that's fine. I'm here. I'm nice and tight. Now with my foot and hip, I'm going to push up and over. I like holding on the arm because now we're ready to attack the arm. But for today, we're just going to base out. Hip bump sweep from a different angle. So our partner has their hands on the floor. Uh, for drilling sakes, when you're the partner, make sure you're looking up, right? So people get tired or they're not paying attention. They come down and the person accidentally hits them in the chops. So always stay postured up. So grab the wrist, I'm going to hip out, cup over the shoulder nice and tight. My far foot and hip is what's giving me power. I'm going to go up and over. Here, I'm going to come up, up and over. Base out, stay low. 